Hello viewers, in this video we will see calculation of cash from operation and this is the format of cash flow statement. We saw this in detail in our previous video. Those who didn't watch the previous video, you just watch that and this is the format. Okay, we here we have three kind of activities that is operating activity, investing activity and financing activity. Okay. These are the basic three activities. Now we will see one problem. Calculate cash from operation from the following profit and loss account. Okay, the profit and loss account was given. Okay, and uh, using this we have to find the cash from operation. As per the format, we are going to calculate the cash from operation. Okay, here we have salary, rent, depreciation, loss on sale of plant. Goodwill return of proposed dividend, provision for taxation, net profit, gross profit, profit on sale of land, income tax refund. Okay, from this profit and loss account, we will take only the non operating expenses and income. Okay, the expenses which is not related to the operation of the business that is non operating expenses and the income which is not related to the operation of the business is non operating incomes okay here the list of non operating expenses and incomes are depreciation loss on sale of plant goodwill return of proposed dividend provision for taxation and the income profit on sale of land income tax refund okay this alone will take it in order to calculate the cash from operation okay because this salary and rent are the operating expenses okay this don't have any picture in this cash flow statement okay yes we'll start doing the problem as per the format we'll start first we have to write the net profit okay here the net profit was given that is 10,000 I have written it that okay and now we have to add our proposed dividend provision for taxation and transfer to reserve is there no Okay, so we can write this alone. Proposed dividend, yes, 5000 and provision for taxation, 5000. Okay, and in outer column, we we'll write 10,000 because we have to add this two. Yes, and if we add this, we'll get 20,000. This is the net profit before tax and extraordinary items. Okay, and now we have to add the non operating expenses that is depreciation loss on sale of plant goodwill return off and proposed dividend and provision for taxation we already wrote okay so now we have to write the depreciation yes it's 2000 i have written okay next one is goodwill return off it's 4000 and next is loss on sale of plant it's 1000 okay we finish writing everything okay the expenses so we'll get 7000 is the non operating expenses so we have to add this so 20000 plus 7000 will get 27000 and next now we have to write the non operating incomes that is profit on sale of land and income tax refund here we have first i have written profit on sale of land it's 5000 and income tax refund we have to write that is 3000 so we have to subtract this that is 8,000, 27,000 minus 8,000 will get 19,000. This is the operating profit before working capital changes. And this is also known as funds from operation. Okay. And now we have to add the decrease in current assets and increase in current liability. But here we don't have current assets and current liability. And we have to subtract the increase in current assets and decrease in current liability that too we don't have okay so decrease in current assets increase in current liability is nil and increase in current assets and decrease in current liability we have to subtract that also nil so this funds from operation will be the cash from operation okay yes cash from operation is 19,000 okay I hope now you can able to calculate cash from operation as per this accounting standard 3 format right and this format is a new format and this is uh, considered as an indirect method okay and this is the new method for calculating this cash from operation and it is very easy to calculate right 
and I have given you a similar kind of problem for you to practice. You just work out the problem and come on the answer. I'll check your answer. Thank you for your patient listening.